Hi, my name's Santiago, and welcome to the JCU Cairns Ideas Lab. The JCU Ideas Lab is obviously an amazing building. It's more than that though, it's a, it's a space where we can bring some really key components of the uh, innovation ecosystem together. The, the core JCU component that lives in here is centered around Internet of Things, so sensors, uh, data science and artificial intelligence. Here is a piece of uh, Festo process simulation equipment. So the third year uh, process and automation students, their task is to program this machine to run as efficiently as possible. Uh, this bit of equipment would be something that you'd find in a manufacturing environment. We're really starting to pump through researchers and students developing world-class tech companies which stay in the region because they're aligned to specific problems that occur in this region and also in the tropics. From a building perspective, we're very conscious that um, to do innovation you need to be able to have spaces to collaborate. You need a, a space where you, you feel that ideas can flow, that's got abundance of natural light. Um, and multiple ways people can engage with each other and a high degree of transparency so they can all see and feed off each other within that space. There's a lot of unique things in this project which, which took a long time to develop, um, understand how it was going to be through shop drawings and samples and, and looking at buildability issues. So there's a lot of uh, things that took quite a while to work our way through but uh, in the end the result's right behind us. It was a huge jump for me from being a uh, tradesperson on the tools to uh, being part of the project management team to provide you this amazing building. Now we linked in some, some really good smart local subcontractors. We pretty much had nearly all local subcontractors, the exception were a couple of specialists from Brisbane and a couple from uh, Townsville, but the rest were all, all local subcontractors. Worked on basically the entire steel steel work in the building, um, the staircase and the stainless steel handrails, which is a bit of an uh, eye-opener to work on that. Definitely some challenges involved in the design and construction of something like this, so it was really uh, a good challenge and um, something that we're all able to um, learn from and um, enjoy doing. We looked at how we can engage into the, the Indigenous community, so we set up a steering committee which met monthly. The end result was our, our levels nearly doubled what we expected um, initially to target, so the end result was uh, pretty fantastic. My fellow in Indigenous people were getting work, not only that, they were getting work that they could uh, get good experience in and then uh, hopefully learn uh, some new things and take that into their, their own, develop their own path. So overall we think a very successful job. Well it's going to change the region um, and you know I firmly believe that. Yeah.